Hello, welcome to DIY Machines, where we're building this, our 3D printable Arduino powered robotic bartender. This is a very short part three where we'll go through fitting the backboard that's going to hold our optics in place. Start with some shelf brackets, you can find these in any DIY store. I've used a piece of board to help hold the bracket in the right place so I can make sure the screws are going in the right position. When selecting your screw, make sure it won't go all the way through the board or you'll see it on the other side. The screw is too long so I've added two washers so it doesn't go so deep. Repeat this again for another bracket at the other end of the board. To ensure that the board is the right distance away from the paddle, slide the paddle to one end and measure 26mm from the back of the paddle to the board. Repeat this going along the board by moving the paddle along and checking the distance again. Once you've got this right, you can screw it down from behind through the shelf brackets. Repeat this again for the other bracket. Before we fit the optic to the board, we need to level your paddle. Put something straight across it and screw the threads by hand until you have a nice perfect level across the top. Slide your paddle to the end, about one centimetre or so away from the contact switch. Position the optic holder over the centre of the hole of the paddle. It needs to be about this far apart so that the paddle can move freely underneath. Mark this point now. Remove the optic from the holder. Reposition the bottle holder on the board above your little mark and then check its vertical with a spirit level. Mark this point again at the top of the board. Now make some small marker holes. I'm using my drill bit to make a little scratch on the board. Once you've finished the first one, check that the paddle can still move freely underneath the optic. Continue adding more optics. I've spaced mine 12.5cm apart. I only have four for now, but I'll buy two more shortly. Hope you've managed to follow along this video with ease. If you've had any problems, please comment below and I'll do the best I can to help you out. So that you don't miss the next video, please subscribe. Otherwise, ciao for now.